All right. Uh, yeah, this should be like, this should be like a hard, like, this should be a kick in the teeth kind of loss. They, this is just the worst possible map with the worst possible, the worst possible situations. Oh, then I, then I pull that stupid nonsense. Did I get this? She doesn't know how much stock I had. She didn't know that I just, like, messed the stock up. She should go the other way. Okay. Palace, like right here, right? Ah! Oh, that's unfortunate for you. So they did not have a harasser. They got agenda, which is great for them. But I don't know. I don't know. Like I, I feel like if you're gonna be a killer, if you're gonna be a survivor, this is the game. This is the game you want to be. You want to play Ghostface against. I think. Well, there it is. There you have it. There's nothing else I can do right now. That's fine. Are you gonna are you gonna give me altruism kills? Are you gonna give me altruism kills? There's that. Now what? He's already on death hook. And now you're not doing gens, guys. That person bots out because they don't want to play it. She's down on hook. I don't care. I already have a hook. Now I have a bot. And so, again, should I have lost this game? No. First off, she's not helping this person out at all. There's another bot. Because she doesn't want to, like, they don't want to play a game that's not fun. to play a game that's not fun. But here I am, playing in this game. And I can make it unfun. I can take their fun away as a killer. And on one hand, yes I can, but I, I shouldn't have to. I shouldn't, first off, the fact that I don't do this, I'm demonstrating a flaw in the design. I'm demonstrating the problem. These survivors are fed up. They're fed up in a game that doesn't help them. They're fed up in a system that continues to cater to people who just, just wanna win. So they play in this way and they get what they want out of it. And, and what, what's anyone supposed to do? Oh, that was nice. That was nice. Oh, 
I hope you can run me for two gens. Oh, that was good. I just zone you out here. As long as I don't let you back at that house, I'm good. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, wow, she's gonna loop all the way around here. Oh, look at that. Oh, that perk really stopped me. And then she bots out because who wants to play in a game that's no fun? The killer, by the way, he's like, oh man, these survivors are entitled. These survivors, they're not playing right. They should play more tactically. They should be like swift, professional gamers. And that, that, and that bot literally just told me where she is. Dear Dead by Daylight, please make it so that your bots don't make it easier to win. Watch this, guys. Watch, watch what I do here. This is, this is, this is high level bot right now. Oh, nice. The end. 4K, one gen left. And these guys will have every right to be living. They will have every right to, to be frustrated. Because what were they supposed to do? I cannot see. This is not a problem. I wonder if that's like a thing for everyone. Okay. All right, bot. What are you going to do? They don't, these guys, you know, I, I regret the necessity of this demonstration to sit here and point out like survivors don't want their friends to die on hook. Survivors don't want their friends to be, to be miserable because they're being camped. They don't want to be camped. They don't want to be tunneled. And so then they bought out. But my message to you survivors who don't want to be who don't want to be camped and whatnot, the worst thing to do is to validate the playstyle I'm currently using. Because what you've just done is you validated the playstyle. You rewarded it by trying to help your friend. And that's miserable and awful and terrible. But the only way around it is, oh, hey, buddy, you, you're on hook. Sorry, you, you go ahead and die. And we'll do the gens and we'll get out and we'll win, which is the way you punish it. I've seen it happen. I've documented it. But, but should this be a factor? And I'm going to keep doing this until Dead by Daylight makes it impossible.